Yo! What's going on everybody and welcome back. I am the Game Shark, and today we have episode 31 of our Pokemon Emerald Gainlock. And in the last episode, we made our way to the top of Mount Pyre here, and in today's episode, we're gonna see what kind of bullshit's going on behind us. Now I did fly back to the PC and heal up the squad off screen. So the squad is ready, I am ready, and if you guys are ready, let's get the show on the road here. Alright. I'm gonna tread lightly because. Okay, I see what's going on. Can I sneak by you? I can! Let's see what's over here first. So obviously Team Aqua's up to no good in the neighborhood. That was awful. Found a zinc! Too bad the bag is full! Okay, well, needless to say, after this, we are going to consolidate the bag a little bit. Hmm... I don't really know what to get rid of. That's the prob. Let's toss this burn heal. Because we have five full heals. And we can take care of any burns with one of those. So we're going to have to go ahead and use this zinc right away. Actually. Uh, special defense. Let's see here. King? Of course not. Nagini? Of course not. Uh, Furby Boy? Of course not. Let's see, Jet? There you are, boy, alright. At least somebody can use it. Let's see if there's anything else over here. Doesn't appear to be. Quite a few hidden items over yonder, though. Alright, let's fight this dude. So Team Aqua's up to no good. We have to thwart their plans. Ha! Too bad for you! If you came earlier, you only would have had to battle the Wimpy Team Magma. But since you arrived now, you have to take us on Tuffies! Take on us Tuffies. Ah. Now I get it. Ugh! That voice really hurt my throat. He's got one Pokemon, it's Carvana. Level 32. Okay. So, dark water, right? So you would hate a bug type move, bro. You would hate it. Furby might even get to level 38 here. Wow, you loathe it. You loathe it. That a boy Furby. Rough skin, whatever, dude. Whatever. And you know what? I think Voltage got to like level 35 or so in the last episode. So it might be time we take off his uh, experience here. Yeah, level 35. Let's see how close he is to a 36. Uh, maybe we'll keep it on until he gets to level 36, and then we'll take it off. Let's, what's behind you? Whoa, there's more grass? We already have our encounter from Mount Pyre. It was a flippin' Kecleon, which sucks, but hey, a Pokemon's a Pokemon. You know, I'll take it. Look at Zung, we have seen these. They were inside, though. Let's see. Wow, you're tough. Alright, I'm not trying to spend all day screwing with the Lick it's but Furby did get to level 38, not too shabby. That a boy Furbs. That a boy Furbs. So with that, let's put Jet up front because I'm thinking Team Aqua usually has a lot of dark type. And Jet could be of some use with his fighting type moves, right? That's what I'm thinking at least. Breakthrough. That a boy. Level 20, 38 now. Damn, the whole squad of 38. I think, actually, the whole squad other than Voltage is at level 38. That's pretty sweet. King's at 39. Ah, uh, what are you gonna do? He's so powerful anyway. Nothing over here. Okay. Let's continue climbing up here. <sighs> no! Those Team Magma goons got here ahead of us! We can't fall behind! Of course not, of course not. Better to get to get back to get to better. Team Aqua Grunt, he's got one Pokemon, it's a Zubat. Uh, I don't think Zubat will have any flying type moves. Even if he did, he'd have to catch a humongous crit to kill us. So let's go with the Surf. Suck it, dude. Damn, Jet. Damn. Alright, we do have a double battle ahead of us. So who do we put up there? I like Jet, because he's got the Surf. And let's go King to play it safe. Saw, dudes. Oh no! You tried to join Team Magma, but they wouldn't have they wouldn't have had you! 
They wouldn't have you? They wouldn't have you. That's what she said. Well, don't think that we'll let you join our team, Aqua. You. We saw you at Mount Chimney. You don't belong to either team, so why would you be here? Because I'm trying to destroy both of you guys. You're both up to no good in the neighborhood. Thought I was causing trouble in the neighborhood. I got one little bit and my mom got scared. She said, you're moving with your uncle and your auntie in Bel Air. Okay. So, I don't think we'll go for the surf here. I'd rather go for Rock Smash on Puchiana. And then we can go for a Strength on Whalmer. Let's see what happens here. Oh, oh, oh. I really did not think that would one-hit KO. It's Rock Smash. It's not even that good of a move. Voltage to 36. That a boy. That a boy. Look at you go. Damn, dude. Not the best stats in the world, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Carvana. Okay, okay. Strength or strength. Okay, not bad. Whirlpool. Uh-oh. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. Eating that up for breakfast, king. Doesn't matter. We can be hurt by the whirlpool all day. Let's rock smash here. Let's strength once again. If this rock smash kills again. Holy shit, yo. Holy shit. Jet is hitting hard. Who cares about the rough skin? I don't. I surely don't. And then Wilmer can't eat the strength. He just can't do it. He's not strong enough. Little bit of pussy experience, I ain't gonna lie. Last Pokemon here, a Zubat. Really? Really? Let's go for the Surf, and let's go for the Strength. Why not? And I'm 99% sure Surf doesn't hit King. Thank Arceus, because if it did, King would have probably died. <laughs> If you want to join, if you want to join Team Magma that badly, we can consider it. Oh yeah, I whooped your ass. Now you want me to join? If you're going to make a mess with anyone, let it be Team Magma. Whatever, dude. I'm not gonna lie, I dig the bandanas. I dig the striped shirts. But I'm not trying to join any teams here. Let's go ahead. Give me that. What can I give you though? What can we give you? I guess I give you the Macho Brace. Silk Scarf? Nah. Um, it's looking like, I mean, I guess the Quick Claw? Do you really need that, though? For right now, it's looking like the Macho Brace. For right now, I mean, I could, could give you the Cleanse Tag, but I don't know. That's not really worth. Not really worth. <sighs> Here we go. Team Magma's Maxi got ahead of us, but we also got what we wanted. The red orb preserved at Mount Pyre. I, Archie, now have it in my possession. <laughs> now we can bring our ultimate objective to fruition. Okay, team, we're pulling out. Is that really it? I wanted to fight you, dude. I wanted to fight you. I'm not afraid. Oh, no, this couldn't happen. Not only the blue orb, but even the red orb has been taken. The blue orb and red orb must never be separated. They belong together. What are those men trying to do with the two orbs? Oh yes, was it Team Magma who came and took the blue orb first? Well, in their haste, they left this behind. I couldn't imagine what exactly it could be. I would like you to have it. Perhaps it would be useful in some way. The Magma Emblem. Interesting. Interesting. Mount Pyre is where we calm the spirits of Pokemon that have passed on. This is a high place where one can see all of Hone. The disembodied spirits of Pokemon must find solace here. It is in coincidence that you are here. You hear up my tale, a tale long told in the Hone region. Why not? It happened long, long ago. The world was wrecked by a ferocious clash between the Pokemon of the land and the Pokemon of the sea. The Pokemon of the land raised mountains and created continents. The Pokemon of the sea raised huge waves and carved out oceans. The fierce duel raged without end. The world was engulfed in massive and furnace and vicious storms. The blue orb and the red orb brought an end to the calamity. Light poured from the two orbs and become the enraged adversaries. The pair made docile, dove deep into the sea, where eventually they disappeared. So Groudon even dove into the sea? Or is he talking about... No, he can't be talking about Latias and Latios. But no way Groudon would go in the sea, right? 
Like, no way. Hey, hey, hey. Glad we looked over here, huh? Um, but yeah, that doesn't make any sense that Groudon would go into the water. Like, definitely Kyogre. But not Groudon, Haas. Huh? Might need to recount that tail a little bit, buddy. You might have one or two things wrong. Okay, so now what do we do? I believe we probably go to... We could fly. We can fly. Do we need to go down here at all? I mean, we could. We definitely could. Is it worth? I don't know. For now, let's fly to Lily Cove. And then we can try and go back into that Team Aqua's hideout. And maybe uh, we can get in there since we defeated the Mount Pyre situation there. I'm also going to take this opportunity to kind of unload our bag and put what we don't need in the PC. Not Lynette's. My PC. Shark, that's me. Okay, do we have anything in here? No. Let's deposit. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. Let's start with the Miracle Seed. And then we'll do the Everstone. And then we shall do a Heart Scale, a Moonstone, uh, the Charcoal, Firestone, Thunderstone, Leaf Stone, Cleanse Tag. Uh, I believe isn't Jet holding like the Mystic Water, so we don't need Sea Incense. That should do. That should do for now. Not too shabby. Okay, so let's see if we can head in there. I'm gonna say no because all these grunts are still hanging out. And I imagine if we like had defeated it, they wouldn't be here anymore. Only one way to find out for sure though. What, what? Are you a Team Magma grunt? I hear that Team Magma is trying to awaken an awesome Pokemon at their hideout. But where might their hideout be? Will you tell me? Mount Chimney. Thanks, bud. So, let's hop on Hedwig here and get on our way until her daddy rolled up in a Chevrolet. Fall art. Mount Chimney's around here somewhere, right? Okay, so, what's the best way to get to Mount Chimney? I'm gonna imagine. Shit, Lava Ridge? I mean, I guess that makes sense. Let's start with Fall Arbor, though. Let's start with Fall Arbor. Okay. A battle tent. Um, um, um. While we're here, we actually need some Paralyzed Heals. So, I think we're good on Great Balls. We could scoop up nine more Super Potions. Uh, Solid on Antidotes. Let's go ahead and pick up three Paralyzed Heals, and let's call it good. All good, Shopkeep. Thank you. I'm going to hop on my bike, and let's see. A Masquerain. Wow. I don't know if we've seen one of those before. Well, it's dead now, so that's all that matters, really. Nothing down here. Oh, nailed it. Got out of there. Okay. Um, boom. -da 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 -da. Will this take us into Mount Chimney? Fiery path. I feel like we're on the right path here. I could be wrong. I feel like every time I play third gen, I always kind of get... No, we're definitely good. We're right. I was going to say, every time I play 3rd gen, it's around this part of the game where I always get tripped up and forget what I need to do. So, we didn't take on uh, Archie of Team Aqua, but maybe we'll take on Team Magma here and maybe even take on Maxi. We shall see. We shall see. Okay, we'll go to the tippy top. We shall go to the tippy top. No... This old lady wants to fight? I've been to the hot springs and refreshed my tired bones. 
Right now, I'm feeling strong. I bet, lady. I bet. What if she just has, like, some monster Pokemon? Meditite? Mmm. Not quite what I was thinking. Detect. Oh, come on. Come on. Uh, yeah, let's just go for the spark. I was going to think maybe about doing a rollout, but I'm pretty sure he is part fighting type, so that probably wouldn't do too much. A Makuhita? Let's go out to Furby Boy. Furby Boy? I don't know, I just thought of Pegasus from Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu-Gi Boy! Alright, Makuhita. Psybeam's pro- Ooh, not bad. I thought Fake Out always makes the opponent flinch. Am I thinking of a different move? It would appear so. Oh, this old lady wants my phone number? That's weird. Was she she was running in place. Okay. We'll smoke these two guys real quick. No big deal. A Geodude and a Meryl. Um. We'll spark the Meryl. We'll strength the Geodude. Geodude's probably gonna... Yeah, I was gonna say... He's gonna resist that. Why am I... Whatever. I don't think a level 21 Geodude can one-hit KO either of these Pokemon, so we should be fine. Should be fine. Mudsport. That's like the first time I've ever seen Mudsport do... Like, anything. Like, something of value. Whatever. You're both dead. I don't want to give either of you my phone number. Damn it. Alright. Well, we do have the Magma Emblem. Why? Alright. You're part ground type. So... I'm gonna dip set. Magnitude. We can eat that up. Now you're dead. Alright. Sorry for kind of speeding up through all that, but... I mean, I feel like there's more? I'm going to keep speeding up because we don't need to see all this. This is all bullshit. Leaf Seed. Unbelievable. 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 I'm about to pull my hair out. This shroomish is driving me nuts. Hold on to this acid, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. And there's nothing up here anyway. Okay. So, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, um, they must be inside? They must be inside, trying some bullshit, and we're gonna go stop them. By golly, we're gonna go stop them. So, let's go down. If you wanna fight me, dude. Alright, good, I've already been down here. So, we know they're in Mount... Oh. Oh, this boulder is shaking in response to the magma emblem. Sweet. I was going to say, like, we've been here. I don't know if anything is new. But here we go. Magma hideout. This is a new... This is a new encounter. Our encounter for the magma hideout is a Don fan. So, it's the same as Fiery Pass. However... Uh... I mean, it's, it's a different place, so we can still catch it. I'm gonna get the hell out of Dodge. Um. Ah, shit. I'm kind of afraid of this thing. I'm kind of afraid of this thing. I'm pretty sure he's pure ground type. Pretty sure. Fury attack. I'm not gonna do shit, dude. That ain't gonna do shit. Let's hypnotize you. And then I'll rock smash you a couple times, I guess. Maybe just once. Oh, no, a couple times. One more. He wakes up. Goes for the defense curl. So maybe I'll rock smash once more. Don't crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. Perfect. Perfect. Go to sleep, little boy. Oh, it's a girl. She's a pretty elephant girl. Do you think a Pokeball will do it? By golly, I think it would. How about Daphne the Don fan? Sounds good to me. The armor Pokemon. A Don fan is so strong, it can easily haul a dump truck. Damn, if you were a dude, I would have totally named you Dump Truck. Its hide has toughened to a rock hard state. An ordinary sort of attack won't even leave a scratch. Daphne the Don fan, for sure. That's a C. Daphne the Don fan. Oh, yeah. 
All right, let's continue on here. Good thing we have a Pokemon with strength. That would have been a pain in the ass if we didn't. Uh, maybe we should throw Jet to the front of the party as well. Since Team Magma would probably use fire and ground types. Wow, there is Houndoom in here? That would have been sick, dude. That would have been sick. More Don fan, that's cool too. Um, unfortunately, I mean, we can't use either of them. Let's see, what do we have? Six badges? Six badges. We have... Fugging type, Poison type, um, shit, Electric, Rock, I think, Fighting type, Poison type, Electric, Flying, Rock, and Fighting type, <laughs> Poison type, Rock type, Flying type, Poison type, and one more I can't think of, uh, I don't know. Let's fight this dude. Let's fight this dude. Our leader told us to dig into Mount Chimney, so we dug and dug. And in the course of digging, we came across something that blew our minds. What did we find? <laughs> I'll tell you if you beat me. Holy shit. This guy's tough. Bannet. Bannet. Other than the hood, Team Magma's pretty sweet. I don't dig like the whole ears popping out of the hood. But other than that, they're pretty cool. They can hang. Should've went for the Rock Smash, but hit Surf on accident. Should've saved the PP. Oh well, it's still one hit KO'd. Maybe now this guy will tell me what they found. Ugh! Taken down! Tell me. I won't tell you after all. You'll find out when you get there. It'd be better if you save surprises to the end, don't you think? Wow, that's some deep shit. And you know what? I think we're gonna do the same. We're gonna save the surprise for the end of probably the next episode because we're going to call it an episode right here thank you so much for joining us today you guys if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button if you liked the video today hit that like button and if you have any questions for me leave them in the comment section down below and don't forget to check out the question of the day but we're going to call it an episode right here i am the game shark and i'll see you guys next time see ya